The Northern Melbourne Institute of TAFE is a recognised and certified educational institute to the Victorian public with a wide range of courses across a number of disciplines. NMIT is proud to offer aquaculture at both degree and certificate levels. 2006 saw the Australian Government identify the need for practical tertiary qualifications in the field of aquaculture. In response, NMIT established a degree program to ensure students make an immediate impact upon entering the industry. Aquaculture is the farming of aquatic animals, including fish, mollusks, crustaceans, algae and aquatic plants. Aquaculture is one of the fastest growing primary industry in the world. In early 1950s, total aquaculture production was less than 1 million metric ton. In 2008, total aquaculture production was over 52 million metric tons. Our mission is to provide students with training in areas appropriate to the global aquaculture industry and environmental management industry. We aim to transfer knowledge and understanding of aquaculture industry through interaction with industry people, excellence in teaching and training. The Aquaculture and Environmental Management course at NMIT allows students to use specialist equipment and facilities for studies in recirculation of freshwater and saltwater tanks. The water in all fresh and saltwater systems pass through a number of high-tech mechanical and biological filtration systems, which allows the water to be reused continuously. Only 5% of the water in the systems are discharged or replaced on a daily basis, making the systems very environmentally friendly as they limit pollution and are very efficient users of water. These tanks create the basis for the course and are used for specialised areas of study including aquatic animal culture, water quality monitoring, environmental management, fish reproduction and conservation. The degree of aquaculture utilises various specialist labs which are used for practical applications in biology, agology, chemistry and microbiology. Activities performed in the lab include analysis of fish anatomy, the testing of zooplankton and algae for feeding and most importantly research of microbial activity in aquaculture. Microbiology and aquatic animal health and diseases are significant components of the course, with students learning the identification of microorganisms and diagnosis of fish diseases. They collect aquaculture water and animal tissue samples and then culture microorganisms in the laboratory and finally identify microorganisms using various biochemical techniques. This process is fundamental for developing new measures to keep aquaculture animals healthy for breeding and growing out and helps to produce quality products for human consumption. Biology and aquatic animal culture are only a few of the many areas studied in the Bachelor of Aquaculture and Environmental Management, with other areas including animal husbandry, aquaculture engineering, environmental policy and management, aquatic animal diseases, and restoration of aquatic habitat. Students are also educated in the field of fish reproduction and genetics, with NMIT breeding the highly sought after Murray cod since 2009. Oh, reproduction and breeding is one of the most important things that you'll find in the degree program, and certainly the reason for that is because we've got so much industry emphasis on it. Um, the fish that we're looking at at the moment, things like Murray cod and silver perch are some of the most um, important species for aquaculture in the country in terms of the freshwater environment, but they are threatened in the natural environment, so what we want to do eventually is show the students how to breed and produce these fish, and that will enable them to uh, go into industry, make an immediate impact within the industry, and also to uh, enable us to undertake restocking in the future uh, of natural waterways, which is something that we want to do as well. The process of inducing reproduction in the Murray cod begins with stimulating the release of eggs and sperm. This is done by injecting the parent fish with specific hormones. The eggs are then removed from the female and fertilised with the sperm. After being released into hatching tanks for a predetermined amount of time, the first hatchings occur. The course also promises to educate students in the culinary aspect of aquaculture, with students learning how to descale, clean, fillet and smoke fish, all for human consumption.
In addition to the use of on-campus facilities, students also embark on a number of field trips each year to supplement their understanding of aquatic environments. Due to a high demand for renewable and sustainable seafood sources and an emphasis on marine life conservation in Australia, job possibilities are virtually endless. The Bachelor of Aquaculture and Environmental Management at NMIT prepares students for full-time work in these areas, with graduates finding employment in workplaces ranging from government bodies to private fish farms. When I finished school, I decided to take the course due to its high practical components. I liked the idea of being involved in something that was working towards a more sustainable future. When I first discovered aquaculture as a future career prospect, I mainly believed that it was only focused primarily on just fish farming. Now that I've actually become involved in the course, I've realised that career prospects are endless and I'm really looking forward to being involved in the industry. Um, aquaculture is a very wide ranging industry. Uh, anything that which is grown in water is considered aquaculture. Fish farming is the most uh, well-known aquaculture industry. Uh, however, there's many other industries which culture things in water. Um, when I finished the course, I got into biotechnology, growing microalgae uh, for various uh, uses. Uh, the information I learnt in the course got me to this career path, and uh, I didn't think I'd be here today. I would definitely recommend this course to others. The practical, hands-on based learning has taught me things that I wouldn't have learnt in a theoretically based course. NMIT recognises students who complete prior learning before they enrol in other courses from any institute across Australia. If you have already completed a course, enrolment into aquaculture at NMIT might only be a step away. The Bachelor of Aquaculture and Environmental Management is a three-year course offered at NMIT's Epping campus, located 22 kilometres from Melbourne Central Business District. For more information about this course, please contact 03 9269 1042 or email aquaculture at nmit.vic.edu.au. For international students, please inquire through the NMIT International Office on 03 9269 1666 or email international at nmit.vic.edu.au.